Adventures in Pixieland presents your daily energy. Today's astrological forecast for April 30th, 2023 is the waxing gibbous moon in Virgo, trine Mercury retrograde in Taurus. Sorting through your ideas and plans now will help you be ready to take action later. Think, how can I be better enabled to strike while that iron is hot? Today's Elder Futhark Daily Rune for April 30th, 2023 is Berkana. Berkana, the letter B, meaning birch goddess. Yes, the tree, birch. Associations, growth, new beginnings, renewal, birth and rebirth, spring and fertility. Today's context is that today your focus is on new things. Growth and development energies are in the air. Whether it be something brand new or rebirth of something existing. Your daily romance angel oracle card for April 30th. 2023 is keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Keep an open mind. The meaning? The romance angels sent you this card as a reminder to stay open to the possibilities of your soulmate appearing in a form that may differ from what you expect. This is especially true if you tend to date a certain quote-unquote type of individual. This card was drawn to help you discover your soulmate. This card may sing signal that you have already been introduced to this person but have overlooked his or her or their romantic potential. Take the time to get to know the various individuals you meet, even if there isn't an initial attraction. At the very least, you will learn more about yourself and may make a new friend. Today's Fairy Wisdom Oracle card for April 30th, 2023 is Bad Dragon. Bad Dragon. Keyword, judgment. This is a let yourself off the hook day. The bad dragon card indicates that you or someone is being chastised. Look within. Is it you judging yourself, a situation, or someone else? View a situation from all sides and ask what lesson it has for you. Release all judgment of yourself or another or a particular situation. For who are you to judge? You draw to yourself the events in your life. You alone must take responsibility for everything that happens in your life. All is but a lesson. So focus on what you have learned. Be easier on yourself and others. After all, even a dragon can have a bad day once in a while. What lessons have you brought into your life? Happiness, sadness. It is through your own powers of manifestation that you create your reality. Your thought patterns and corresponding actions are responsible for your world. What have you thought and done in the past has manifested in the present. So what do you want to change in your present life? What do you want to manifest into your future? Can you see your life is a story in which you get to write the next page and the page after that? The past is just a lesson to learn from. Take the information you've acquired and move forward. Leave any fears, guilt, 
or anger behind. The chant is, I ask in the name of spirit that I be gifted with the insight and knowledge that will keep me on my spiritual path. I ask for help in dealing with all that happens in my life and the ability to learn from it. I ask for guidance that I not be judgmental. Life is but a lesson that leads me to spirit. So be it. Today's daily starseed oracle card for April 30th, 2023 is Earth School. Earth School, life lessons, soul growth, study, higher learning. Planet Earth is a great initiation for the soul. And the life lessons are the curriculum in, for which we enroll. These aren't one-time lessons, but themes we choose to circle around, deepening our experience of them as we make our way through the spiral of life. Life lessons aren't only about getting it right. They're also about getting it wrong. Remembering that Earth is a planet of polarity helps with this understanding. Each year, the study deepens more and more. If you pull this card while you're going through a difficult time, you're being prompted to remember that your soul came here to grow and learn. Try not to look at the difficult times as getting it wrong. Instead, it's opportunities for soul growth. If you can see them this way and find ways to grow and soften your heart through the highs and lows, your soul is most definitely growing, which is the whole point. Pulling this card can also mean that you're being called to embark on a new area of study or growth. This could be through standard structured learning, such as a university, a school, or a training course. If you're having difficulties in a relationship, you are being reminded that these are opportunities for soul growth. After all, relationships are known as the number one way that we grow as souls while we're here on earth. Soul inquiry, how are you being called to grow and learn? Today's Daily Priestess of Light Oracle card for April 30th, 2023 is clairvoyance. Clairvoyance. Inspiration, interpretation, trust. Clairvoyance, keywords, inspiration, interpretation, and trust. The Oracle of Delphi gazes into her scrying bowl, patiently waiting for the images to take shape. She knows that a message is coming, so she remains peaceful and unafraid. There are two steps to her process, however. Once she receives the information, which often comes in the form of a riddle, she must interpret its meaning. This process applies to your intuitive experience as well. Whether you realize it or not, you too have the ability to receive important messages from spirit. You also have the wisdom to make accurate interpretations. This card is telling you it's time to let go of old doubts and open up to your own clairvoyant process. Like the oracle with her scrying bowl, you might find it helpful to use certain techniques and perhaps specific tools. You may have been called to read oracle cards or pursue mediumship. Whatever form your intuitive process may take, let yourself be a trusting receiver. 
then take your time interpreting the message. It may seem complex at first, like you're putting together pieces of a jigsaw puzzle. But if you relax and let go of the need to perform and the need to be right, soon the answers you seek will become clear. There is something you must know about your oracle powers. There is no wrong seeing. Everything exists in energetic potential. As the energy changes, the outcome you see will change as well. Be open to receiving and patient in your interpretations. Trust yourself, for you are the oracle of your eternal life. Your affirmation, more and more, I trust my own intuitive process. I open to spirit's guidance in understanding the messages I receive. Your daily energy reading for April 30th, 2023 is that the astrology is telling you to focus on your plans and ideas now so you can act faster later. Vericana asks you to focus on growing something, whether that is something new or rebirth. The Romance Oracle says keep an open mind because someone you might not have considered is interested in you. The fairies ask you not to judge yourself today. After all, even dragons have a bad day. The star seed oracle said, you need to remember that we are here to learn from our relationships with others. Learning is our focus, not success or failure. The priestess of light oracle reminds you that you need to slow down and trust the messages you are receiving. As people make decisions, the vision changes. It doesn't mean that you're wrong. It just means they chose a different outcome. In some other metaverse, what you saw is exactly what happened. All these come together for me in a very compatible way. We need to be keeping an open mind. We need to be staying slow. We need to remember that we're here for learning and we need to remember that mindfulness is really what we're after. And getting some pre-planning in will only help you move faster later.